Is your Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Shabbat shalom. All right, looking good, looking good, looking good. This is just so fantastic. So happy for all of us to be here together as friends and family. We're about to sing a little something, and then uh, we'll talk again after that. A little hinim matov umanaim shevet achim gam yachad. How wonderful it is that we get to be here together as friends and family, celebrating Shabbat, celebrating all of these. Phenomenal youth choir participants who are just fabulously wonderful. Here we go. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Shabbat Shalom. Oh, I like that. Uh, my name is David Eschel, one of our rabbis here at Wilshire Boulevard Temple. So wonderful to see you on the Bima here with Cantor Kareth Shapiro. And we also have our cantorial intern, Aliyah Stewart. And we have music educator extraordinaire, <laughs> Ian Simpson. All right, sorry, Tommy. <laughs> Uh, Ian, and then maybe we can introduce the rest of our phenomenal, phenomenal musicians. Yeah, we, we have our celebration team. First of all, I want to recognize our amazing youth choir. And I just have to say, like, we're doing a very cool thing this year. We've got youth choir representatives from this campus on Sundays. You want to raise your hand if you're this campus on Sundays? And we've got representative from Browerman, 
Okay, yeah, raise it. <laughs> proud, proud, no, proud, no, no, proud. No, no, up there, no. up there. And then we have representatives from Resnick on Wednesdays. Yeah, Resnick on Wednesdays. So we're building our junior choirs and bringing them together, and we're super happy that you're here helping us lead. And, um, and we also have um, Susan Rosenstein, our music director, on the keys. We have Brock Pollock on bass, and we have Ava Nahas on yeah. percussion. Our music team, we're so happy to have you here. Um, we're going to continue with uh, this song called Behold How Good. And there's a word in here that I want to make sure you know so you can sing it along with us. It's hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, I think you've got it. They're going to lead you. I always tell them that when they're here with us uh, leading these songs, it's not a performance, mm. that they're leading you in prayer. So I need you to help me. That means please sing along with them so they can really feel like you are leading, they are leading you. Um, and so you just need to know these words, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. And there's a clap in there too. I think you can get it. And we're going to praise together. So now, um, before we continue, let's just turn to the people sitting around us, the people we know, the people we don't. Wish them Shabbat Shalom, 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 everybody. Got you in the Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom. I got you over there. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. Shabbat Shalom. And now we're going to continue with the lighting of our Shabbat candles. And it is my honor to invite up Nina and her family to come light our Shabbat candles. Nina will be coming bat mitzvah next week, but she's here this week with her family to celebrate. So come on up. We're going to be just ready. Let's go ahead and bring that light towards us.
All right, so now we're going to continue with Lecha Dodi as we welcome in our Sabbath bride. We're going to be on page 20. We're going to be on page 20, and we're going to be singing verses 1, 2, and 9. Ooh, 1, 2, and 9. Inspired choice, Cantor. Inspired choice. Here, here we go. Continue now on page 24 with Shalom Alechem.
face the ark and welcome holiness into our midst with our call to prayer, our barhu. to welcome holiness into our midst. standing let's remain standing and we're going to continue now with the watchwords of our people the shema Sorry, come on up, Nina. 
And Nina is going to lead us in the Ve'ahavta. We're going to be on page 36. We're going to continue now with our song of freedom. We're going to continue with Micha Mocha. We are on page 40. Question. Um, who here enjoys hugs? Hugs, hugs. Who enjoys a good hug? Sort of? Really? You don't like hugs? No, no hugs for you? 
Not really. Like, don't touch me. Don't touch me. No hugs. Okay. So for those of you who do enjoy hugs, what are like some of the best times or the most important times to receive a hug? When do you like to get a hug? Oh, and you haven't seen somebody in a long time. Oh, so good to see you. Give me a hug. Oh, yes. Oh, so good. Tight. Nice. When else? When you're sad. Oh, come here. Let me give, oh, let me give you a hug. Right? You get a nice hug. It just feels good, right? Good. When else? When else? Oh, oh, oh. Appreciate you. Thank you. Bo, what you got? Uh, when you fall down. When you fall down, you get up. Oh, you're okay. You're okay. You're, oh, you're going to be all right. Yes. I love that. When else? Have we covered it all? What oh, you got oh. for us? When you're bleeding, you're like, oh, I got boo boo. Boo boo. Let me kiss it, make it better, give you a hug. Yes. When you, when you just when, when you want to get a hug, you just want to get a hug. Yeah. You know what? Why do I have to have a reason? Just give me a hug. I like hugs. What? Yeah. Uh, uh, so, uh, when you want to get a hug, you say please. Oh. May I please have a hug, right? Asking for consent, very it's important. It's always good to ask. Yes, very good. You can say please, I love that, I love that. Well, you know, for all of these things, I think hugs are just fantastic and wonderful and it just make us feel good. Just makes it, when you're down, it lifts you up. If you're feeling just up, it just brings you even higher. And that's what our next prayer is supposed to do for us, right? Hashkivenu. That uh, shelter beneath, it's that shelter, that warm hug beneath thy wings, the wings of, of Adonai, right? Just having that whole feeling of being enveloped, whether we're down, whether we're happy, whether we're just like, you know what? I don't need another reason to have a hug. I just want a hug. But I always say please. I love that. So let's continue with uh, our, our songs, our song about hug, our prayer about hugs. Uh, the Hashki Venu, we're on page 42. going to continue now. Oh, yeah, you know, because I, I know that's your granddaughter. That's fabulous. <laughs> yes. Oh, Simone, you're, I, you're so fabulous. It was great. Perfect. <laughs> <We're> gonna, 
That's good. We're going to continue now uh, with the Amidah. We're going to be on page 46. Page 46. I'm going to invite us all to please rise. And again, I would like to invite up fabulous Nina to the ark to lead us in the Amidah. Please rise. Adonai sefatai tifta ufi agite hilateha baruhata Adonai Eloheinu Elohe avotenu vimotenu Elohe Abraham Elohe Isaac Elohe Yaakov Elohe Sarah Elohe Leah Elohe Rahel, Elohe Leah, Ha El Hagadol, Hagibor, Vamora, El El Yom, Gomel Hasadim Tobim, Vikone Hakol, Bezoher Haste, Avot Vimaho, Ume Vikibula, Leave Nevenehem, Lemashimo Beahava. Melehozer Umoshia Umage Baru Hata Adonai Megin Abraham Bezrat Sarah Atagi Borle Lam Adonai Mehaye Hakulata Rav Leoshia Meshiv Harua Umerid Hagashem Mehakel Hayim Ber Hesed, Mehaye Hako Ber Rahabim Habi, So Mech Nochim Ber Ohe Holy, Umat Mi Asurim, Umekaye M Unato, Mishene Hapa, Mi Hamo Hapa Ageguro. Umi domela melech me mit ume haye umats mi aheshua le en eman hata le hahayota baru hata adonai me haye hako. Beautiful. We remain standing and we continue silently through page 62 and we'll remain standing until the ark is closed.
Oh, so good, so good. So, okay. <clears throat> uh, so Thanksgiving is coming up, and which is fabulous. And I want to share with you one of my favorite, get ready for this, one of my favorite pieces of Wilshire Boulevard Temple trivia. Get ready for this. This is fantastic. Mark, you got something to say? You raising your hand? Oh, no, you weren't. Be careful. You raise your hand, I'm going to call on you. That's, uh, that's what I'm going to do. You know I do that. Um, so, Wilshire Boulevard Temple, the original name, do you know what the original name of Wilshire Boulevard Temple was? Congregation B'nai B'rith. Congregation B'nai B'rith. And we were Congregation B'nai B'rith until we moved to Wilshire Boulevard. And we were still Congregation B'nai B'rith when we were on Wilshire Boulevard. You could even see on one of the cornerstones, it says Congregation B'nai B'rith. It was changed to Wilshire Boulevard Temple because people would be like, oh, you know that temple on Wilshire Boulevard. Where's that? Oh, that temple on Wilshire Boulevard. So then it became Wilshire Boulevard Temple. But we were Congregation B'nai B'rith. And we were founded, get ready for this, get ready for this, 1862. Sukasa, earlier than 75, 1862. Now, get ready for this. Do you know who was president of the United States of America? Abraham Lincoln was president when our congregation was founded. Okay, now get ready for this. Abraham Lincoln signed into existence the official holiday of Thanksgiving in 1863. So we are older than Thanksgiving. I love it. Yeah, it's fantastic, right? Um, and Thanksgiving is one of my favorite holidays, and here's why. So when my children were little, uh, on the drive to school, we would listen to a lot of different things. One of, one, one of the, uh, the artists that got a lot of play, it was a, a, a band called the Charettes. The Charettes, right? it was a fabulous music. And one of their songs that got a lot of play was, um, uh, it was a song called Toda, which means thank you, right? It says, Toda is a very special word. It's the very best word I ever heard. I sing it when I wake up. I sing it every day. I sing it from my heart because that's the Jewish way. Yes, it's the Jewish way to say thank you, toda, right? We say it modani in the morning. We say uh, we are so grateful. And thank you, these two seemingly simple teeny tiny words are actually so very powerful on so many levels, right? For the person who is saying thank you, right? For the person who is saying thank you, it's saying, you know what? I can't do this alone. I can't go through the world alone. I can't do everything by myself. The way to true success is with the help of others, right? And in doing so, you say, Thank you. It acknowledges, right, that I can't do this alone. It's not just about me. And then the one who receives the thank you, right, the one who receives the thank you, it says, wow, I have purpose, right? I'm not here on this earth by accident, but I have meaning to my life and I have purpose because I know that I can help someone else. Right? So those two small words, thank you, or in Hebrew, one word, toda, right? thank you, lets us know that it's not all about us and that we can't do it by ourselves. And at the same time, it helps to give us purpose to say we have meaning in our life to be there for others. Right? And what do we, what do we, what do we eat on Thanksgiving? Turkey, turkey, or, you know, or tofurkey. I eat a tofurkey. I don't, I don't eat, I don't eat meat. I eat fish and eggs, but I don't eat meat, so I'll have a fabulous tofurkey. Uh, but a turkey, and it is the absolutely perfect Jewish food to eat on Thanksgiving. Why? Okay, get ready. So one of the things that we celebrate, God, we say, Hodu la donai kitov. Hodu la donai kitov. 
which mode hodu is like we are when we say hodu ladonai kitov we say that thank you we are praising the our gratitude for god because god is good hodu ladonai kitov and the word for turkey in hebrew is hodu hodu it it means gratitude that we must be gracious and it also means turkey so you could also translate it as God's turkey is delicious. Hodu ladonai kito, right? God's turkey is delicious. So, as you can see, toda, gratitude, is a very, very Jewish thing. So, I guess Thanksgiving is one of my favorite Jewish holidays there is. So, when we are going to be celebrating uh, with friends, family, let's remember as we move through this world, not just on this one day, but every day, to say thank you, to remind us that it's not all about us, and at the same time, to remind us that we all have purpose and meaning in our lives. Shabbat shalom, everyone. Shabbat shalom. <laughs> Rabbi, I have, to, I have a yeah. funny story for I you. I love funny stories. So when I spent my year in Israel studying mm -hmm. as a, a cantorial student, yeah. Um, it was very hard to find a turkey. Very hard to find, well, yeah. like an actual turkey. You can find like the lunch meat. No, 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 like I wanted to cook an actual yes. turkey. Like we wanted to, our, the American people, we wanted to have Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah. So, but, and oddly, the only place we could find a, a Thanksgiving dinner was in East Jerusalem at a hotel. And we went and we had like this wonderful Thanksgiving meal. And uh, so it just, as you were sharing that, it just made me think like, oh, I, I pray for a time when we can give thanks, that that'll be a, a place where I would uh, be able to be <laughs> celebrating Thanksgiving Amen. again. Amen. So, yeah, yeah. Amen. It's beautiful. Um, we're going to take the time now to think about those in our lives, in our families, our community, in our world. <laughs> Boy, in our world. Um, those that are in need of healing, whether that's physical healing, mental healing, or spiritual healing. Today, specifically in our community, we would like to recognize Michael Alkov, Rick Frankel, Sophia Rachel Gadushi, Hilly Gordon, David Iskowitz, Judith Salter, Charles Schwartz, Shraga Stern. If you are thinking of anyone else today, I invite you, I invite you to please rise and say those names, either in your hearts or out loud as my eyes meet yours. to those names, all of the, the families who are in so much pain and suffering uh, in Israel as a result of October 7th and the families waiting to hear about their loved ones and uh, those who are also recovering physical, mental, spiritual pain. We continue with a Misha Berach prayer for healing. We're in the middle of page 253.
So now we have the opportunity, as this is Celebration Shabbat, uh, to invite up anyone who perhaps is having a birthday this month, or an anniversary, or celebrating. We don't volunteer. We don't volunteer. Only I get to volunteer. You don't get to volunteer. You're 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 soft over there. You're, but uh, only uh, soft. It is your birthday. You're coming up. It's okay. Come on up. If anybody is celebrating a birthday, an anniversary, something special, a milestone in your life, something that you just feel like something is wonderful happened with you. A bat mitzvah. a bat mitzvah coming up. I don't know. Maybe Nina. With your family, come on up. Anybody, anybody, anybody. Uh, something special and fabulous going on in your life. If you feel that, come on up. Why don't you come up and be with Safta? Yeah. Sure, let's go in front of New York. If we can, let's just be careful, be careful. Watch your step. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, are we coming? Susan Rosie, what's going on? What? What? What are we? Are we celebrating something? Come, 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 come. I know, I'm just black. I just want to make sure no one trips over this thing. So uh, as soon as everyone goes by me, then I'm going to ask. So great. Okay. So I'm going to come over here. What are we celebrating over here? E. <laughs> We're celebrating E, the letter. I love the letter E. Tonight's Shabbat is brought to you by the letter E. One of my favorite letters. Is this Shabbat sponsored by letter E? No. Is it somebody's birthday? Mine. It's my birthday, Mazel We're so proud of you. And what are we celebrating over here? I'm turning 13. Congratulations. What are we celebrating? My sister's bar mitzvah. Once you get to that age, you'll 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 know that you get the bar. She gets the bat. We're so, we're so proud of you. You led the prayer so beautifully this evening. Thank you very much. I'm sure it's going to, in two weeks, right? I'm sure it's going to be absolutely wonderful. And over here. I'm going to be 84. Mazal tov. <laughs> and you're here with your, celebrating your mother. Beautiful. And I know what you're celebrating, but I'm going to let you say it. I got a new baby granddaughter. <laughs> and I think we have over here someone celebrating something as well. Would you like to tell us what you're celebrating? It's my first time here. <gasps> oh my goodness. We are so glad you're here and we're so glad that that is something to celebrate. That is so beautiful. birthday and the fact that I'm here with my family. Mazal tov. We're so glad you're here. Happy, happy birthday. All right. Okay. We are going to, we're going to do something. This is so great that this is your first time here. We're going to join the choir. You're totally, you're in. You're in. So... We're going, to, we're going to offer you a special blessing this evening. This is the oldest blessing of the Jewish people. It's been given for thousands of years whenever people celebrated a special moment in their lives. So I'm going to chant it in Hebrew, and Rabbi is going to share the English of that with you. <laughs> May God bless you and protect you. <laughs> May God always shine upon you and be kind to you. know that God is close, and may God grant you the greatest of all blessings, the blessing of peace 
And let us all say, Amen. Mazel tov, mazel tov, mazel tov. I'll invite you back to your seats now. Mazel, mazel, mazel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So good, so good, so good. <laughs> Awesome, beautiful. He's chilling, eh? <laughs> All right. If you want to, yeah, sure, sure. All right, so before we continue, just a few brief announcements. Uh, first, ooh, this is exciting. The opening weekend, finally, of the Resnick Family Campus in just a few weeks. December 8th through 10th, there's gonna be all sorts of phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal celebrations. Uh, and it's over Hanukkah, right? And Hanukkah means dedication, right? Hanukkah is the holiday when we rededicated the temple in Jerusalem. And here we also have the opportunity to rededicate a very special and sacred space to so, so many of us already and what will be for all of us for generations to come. It's gonna be fantastic. Great, and I see there are a few members of, of the adult volunteer choir are here this evening. They're oh, going to be participating in fabulous. that opening. Uh, I did want to share with all of you, if you have an intention yeah. of uh, attending any of those events, it is vital, vital. that you, yes, vital, mm. that you register because we are um, expecting that every event is going to be oversold and we are only going to have uh, so much room. So if you want to come, please, please, please register. Uh, because if you don't, there's a chance you won't make it in. And we want you to be there. So uh, yes, vital. Fantastic. Uh, so also, um, want to make sure you're receiving our emails. If you're not receiving the emails, you should be getting multiple emails a week with all the wonderful programming going on. Uh, in our community. If you're not receiving the emails, please let us know. Please, 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 so we make sure that you are all caught up with what's going on. And you can also check the website for on the uh, calendar to see all the great things that are happening. Um, Cantor, maybe we can thank our phenomenal musicians and then this angelic choir behind yes. me. Yes, thank you so much to Brock and Ava and Susan and Ian and Aaliyah and to our choir. And our new choir member. Um, and now last but certainly not least, Nina, mazel tov to you. So we're going to be together in two weeks celebrating your bat mitzvah. I am so excited to be on the bima with you. I don't know, so <laughs> the other day, I was like last Sunday, I think, at religious school, Nina's littlest brother, Nolan, says to me, hey, Rabbi Eshel, make sure you keep my, uh, my, my sister up to date. Make sure you keep her in check. And I said, Nolan, she's keeping me up to date and in check. So we don't have to worry about that, right? She's taking care of business. So uh, it's going to be so wonderful to be with you and your beautiful family on the Bima. So mazel tov to you. Um, and then following our service, we're going to continue right up here on the Bima with Kiddush and Motzi. And then there'll be some wonderful, wonderful uh, things to eat and drink outside uh, when we in our, in our own egg together. Uh, so with that, I think we're good. All right. Wonderful. Fantastic. Uh, we're going to... Now we're going to take the opportunity... Uh, to think about those in our community, in our lives, who are no longer with us. The following are the names of those in our community who have died during the past 30 days, the past Shloshim. William Bernkrant, Nan Brostoff, Lisa Cohen, Ralph Foxman, Marvin Gerstein, Michael Harris, Rene Dunia, Howley, Stephen Loeb, Gary Winnick. If you are here remembering uh, the death of a loved one over these past 30 days, I invite you to rise and remain standing so we may support you. The following are the names of those in our community who the memorial, the Yotzeit of their death fell during this past week. Alma Abrams, Sarah Nazarian Arkzad, David Barkin, Philip Bartmasser, Samuel Berkowitz, Bernice Bernstein, George Barris, Beatrice Blackman, Samuel Blattis, Estelle Bloomfield, 
Jack Broder, Maurice Chayo, Florence Cohen, Mildred Connie, Ann Cooper, Judy Corman, Saul Cutro, Abraham Diamond, Ruben Dom, Anson Dreisen, Judy Etter, Francine Feynman, Gary Finkel, Eli Fisher, Robert Frankel, Renee Bowden Friedman, Rosalie Friedman, Ella Gamliel, Arnold Gold, Harry Golden, Nathaniel Goldstein, Eddie Gordon, Lazarus Moses Gordon, Minnie Gordon, David Greenberg, Betty Greenberg, James Greenwald, Inez Grover, Carlotta Gertwith, Marvin Jin, Edith Jin, J. Allen Hanover, Gerald Oswald Heyman, Jack Hirsch, Dora Hodes, Francis Lesman, Svi Carney, Nahat Katan, Andrew David Kent, Richard Kirshner, Eric Clapper, Morton Kleinberg, Marvin Komarovsky, Lillian Koslow, Edward Lash, Herman Ira Lawrence, Arthur Levine, Mort Lowey, Sylvia Lurie, Zion Mahani, Estelle Markowitz, Seymour Markowitz, Mildred Brickmayer, Robert Mendelssohn, Carol Miller, Jay Maloney, Emmanuel Morchi, Max Nyman, Arthur Pearl, Samuel Pike, Isaac Pressman, Spencer Pritikin, Fran Rappaport, Edward Maurice Regal, Hermo Rivuario, Benjamin Rubin, Rosangela Lucian Rinsky, Lester Riskin, Jack Robbins, Dora Levy Roddy, Arnold Rolnick, Ruth Rosenberg, Harry Rosenberg, Elias Victor Rosencrantz, Mildred Firth Rosencrantz, Arnold Rosenzweig, Leah Sauter, Carolyn Scher, James London Shandling, Bernard Bud Shields, Barbara Silvers, Joseph Sclaver, Isaac Sklof, Bernie Sloan, Bessie Summer, Annette Sussman, Molly Tuchin, Wally Weissenberg, Blanche Weiner, Geraldine Wilner, Valerie Wolf, Joan Zelkinson. If you are here remembering the death of a loved one who the memorial of their Yorzeit fell during this past week, I invite you to rise and remain standing so we may support you. If you are thinking of anyone else today, I also invite you to rise and remain standing so we may support you. We also remember all of those who have died defending the United States of America. We remember all of those who have died defending the state of Israel. We remember all of those who have died October 7th and the days following. We remember all of those who have died from senseless acts of hatred and terror around the world. We also remember all of those who have no one to say the mourner's Kaddish, the mourner's prayer for them. Uh, and as some of you may have noticed, we also have a, a, a candle, a memorial candle burning here today because all across our great nation uh, was a call out for this to be a unity Shabbat to remember those who have died and that is also a, a massive massive understanding of the word toda. when I was at the rally uh, on Tuesday with 300,000 Americans the Israeli ambassador and those on from Israel, the president of Israel, said thank you to us. They're saying thank you to us. Because so many of us, we feel like, well, what, what can we do? What can we do to help? Showing up is what you can do to help. And our family in Israel recognizes that. They recognize they can't go through this alone. And it also gives us the opportunity to say, you know what, we can do something. So unity and toda. So finally, if you were thinking of anyone else today, or if I mispronounced a name that you know of, I invite you to say those names in your hearts. And now I'd like to invite us all to please rise and remain standing in support of those of us thinking of someone today. Page 294, The Mourner's Kaddish. יתקדל ויתקדש שמי רבה, ביומה דברה חירותי וימליך מלכותי, בחייכון וביומכון ובחיי דחור בית ישראל, בעגלה ובזמן קריב אמרו אמן. יהא שמי רבה מבורך לעולם ומעל מאיה, יתברך וישתבח ויתפאר ויתרומם ויתנשא, 
Vita dal, vita le, vita dal, shme de kudesha brichu. La el al min kol birchata ve shirata, tush pechata ve nechem ata, da amiran be alma vimru, amen. Yehe shlama raba min shemaya, ve chaim alenu ve al kol Israel vimru, amen. O se shalom vimromav, hu ya se shalom alenu ve al kol Israel vimru. Amen.
<laughs> she knows. She knows Away what to do. She knows Jews. what to do. Away from the Jews. Okay. <laughs> Away. Baruch Hatah Lanai Eloheinu Melech Ha'olam Hamosi Le. <laughs>